Hey, what is up geeks? I hope you guys are having a good weekend morning and if you do, make sure to leave a like to show me that you are. So, in this video, I'll be giving you a tour of my new setup. I call this setup the wider than Trump setup. <laughs> I'm just joking. Don't flag me as a racist, alright? Okay, I know it's not as high-end as other YouTubers, but it serves my needs perfectly, actually. First off is the system itself. If you have seen my previous video, you know that I was rocking the AMD system. But this time around, I went with the Intel and NVIDIA stream. I now have the Intel i5-6600 cooled with the ID cooling iSkimo with the beautiful MSI B150M Mortar Arctic. Trust me, it was really hard to find a white PCB motherboard in Malaysia. To feed my Chrome tab addiction are these two beautiful Corsair Vengeance LED RAMs totaling at 16GB which means one of those are 8GB sticks. Although right now in Malaysia there is only one option which is the 3200MHz for those 8GB sticks. It automatically runs at 2133MHz because of the board's limitation but that's fine all together. The graphics card that I'm using is the awesome Zotac GTX 1060 Mini 6GB version and I have to say it is a beauty to have this card on my 1080p monitor. I have a review on this whole system coming up soon so make sure you are subscribed. Powering the whole system is a Corsair CX650M fitting well with my white theme. Shining bright like the diamond it is, I had the Crit Lumax Titan RGB light up my case with all its goodness inside and can serve as a really awesome nightlight as well. And what kind of setup would it be if there was no IKEA furniture, eh? Well, I have the smallest Linman adults that I could get my hands on because I was shopping on a budget. And because, well, you always need that IKEA fake grass. Also, a thing to note, I also hope that you guys love the cable management that I did. I am still using the Dell S2440L monitor and the Edify C3 speaker and although there is a new Corsair K70 Lux in the market with better RGB lighting and such, I find it not much of an upgrade compared to my own Corsair K70 RGB. The Corsair M65 gaming mouse fits perfectly on my hand still and has not failed me yet. And last but definitely not the least, the newest addition to my setup, the Genesis Gear gaming chair. A big thank you to Genesis Gear for sending this out to me. And if you guys don't know it yet, Genesis Gear is a Malaysian brand that seems to me is bringing high quality gaming chair at a much more affordable price so that everyone can get one for themselves. I won't lie, I have been enjoying sitting at my desk for hours editing and gaming without having any problems with my back. When Genesis Gear approached me, I had the liberty to choose the colour, so I chose white so it would fit perfectly with my setup. And no, I will not be sitting like Ed from TechSource for my upcoming videos. Rather, I would be sitting a little bit to the side like this. So that's pretty much it with the tour and links to everything I mentioned is right below in the description. I would appreciate it very much if you guys showed me some love to my channel by hitting the subscribe button and sharing this video around. And I hope a lot more people can get ideas on how to set up their own desktop. I am going to leave you guys to enjoy some hopefully beauty shots of my own setup and stay tuned for more videos. Era of the Geeks baby. Now I focus on hits and collaboration like, like Hold up, cause ain't nobody told us All we knew was cold cuts and cherry fruit roll-ups And now they tell us legend, you want it, you can